there are some things that are just tacky, like socks and sandals. And if you live in one town in Connecticut, that list also includes for sale signs. So much so that they've been outlawed in the swanky community of New Canaan, where Zillow places the median cost of a home at just shy of $1.5 million. The Board of Realtors voted to remove the for sale signs by July 1st, and after a six-month trial, it could become an ordinance. If New Canaan sounds familiar, that may be because, according to Fox News, people like Brian Williams and Paul Simon have property there. But why drop the signs? Well, it's obvious. As one resident explained to Fox, if you drive around this town, it looks like a yard sale. It just looks bad. It starts to look ugly and desperate. Well, technically, it is a yard sale. You're just also selling the house and driveway along with it. Residents do have a bit of a point, though, that so much of real estate happens online now, so the signs might be less necessary than before. Yeah, but then how will you tell your neighbors you're moving? Face to face? Ah!